All right, here's a fun little request that I had. I had somebody ask me, how do you make titles in Cadian Live? So I'm going to give you a tour of the title editor in Cadian Live right now on Spatry's Cup of Linux. Now, I've never really covered titling in Cadian Live because I use third-party software to create my own titles. Namely, I use Blender, and on occasions I use my favorite graphics editor, which is uh, an old version of Macromedia Fireworks for creating uh, transparent PNG files that I can uh, pull into my video productions. You can also use the GIMP as well. Now, this does have a title editor included with it. And I like the title editor because you don't have to have a third-party program like In Inkscape installed to make your titles that you would have to have if you were using OpenShot, for example. And to access the title editor, simply right-click in your area where your clips are stored. You can see I have a background image that I use for some of my videos here. And just right-click and select Add Title Clip. At this point, you're given some options for the type of title that you want to make. You can choose your font and the font size, the font color, whether you want it to be light, normal, demi-bold, bold, black, and you can also choose your outline options. And here, I'm just going to go ahead and type my movie. Okay, now, let's say I want to define the position of the text at the start of the movie and at the end of the movie. Uh, first, what I want to do here is, now that I've got the clip made, I want to ensure that it is perfectly centered on the screen. And then at the start, we can press the edit start here. All right, and then you're going to see this funny, funky looking color here. Well, let's say we want this title to uh, move across the screen diagonally. Well, what you can do is you can drag the start here and you can position this where you want that beginning text to appear. Maybe right about here, okay? And then we can select the end and we can have that text appear here. So literally what's going to happen is this text is going to be moving diagonally. It's going to appear on and then off the screen. Let me show you what I mean here. All right, so now we have our clip we can drag this down to the timeline. Okay, now, by default right now, it is in the clip monitor. You want to go into the project monitor to ensure that you can view this. Okay, and when you drag one of your titles onto the timeline, it is going to create a composite transition. This way, your text is going to appear over any video or graphic that you have. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, move our cursor to the beginning position and have a look and see how this appears. Now, as you can see, it has done exactly what I wanted it to do with the text moving over the screen. And you can use as many of these effects as you want. But why don't we go with something a little bit simpler than that? We can go ahead and delete this title clip here. Okay, well let's have some more fun with the title maker. And actually, today is my first day actually using it. <laughs> I've never used this before, but, you know, I'm just doing this for the sake of uh, a request on the channel. I've never used this before today. Uh, as a matter of fact, about 10 minutes before filming, I made a couple of titles. And I was like, okay, now I can show people how to do this. It's not that hard, really. All right, and we'll add a title clip here. Now, we can also select from a template in a simple scroll. 
it gives a warning that it was made with a different frame size, ignore the warning. Just put in your text, my movie. All right, and we'll make sure that it's centered. Okay, and then press OK. And this is just a simple scroll. And what this one's going to do is, of course, it's going to uh, put it on your timeline with a composite. And pretty much what's going to happen is now it's going to scroll for you. Pretty neat, huh? <laughs> And, of course, you could also make your own static tiles if you wanted to. So, we'll add another clip here. Oh, not a clip. Sorry about that. <laughs> add a title clip. And, uh, huh, what do I want to do? If I just want to do a static title that just sits there... Make sure it's centered. We can uh, choose to make it bold if we want. Uh, looks like that didn't do much for it. Um, we can make it italicized, underlined. Okay, why not? And then, okay. Alright, and then we'll just drag that on the timeline. And pretty much, that's how your title is going to appear. So pretty much, that is the title editor for Cadian Live. Now, if you want some other clip arts and that sort of thing to incorporate into your title, titles, remember that you can always um, go and use the, uh, the um, online resources here, and you can go into the open clip art library and do a search. I'll just search for title. And then some items will come up and appear in a listing here that you can select uh, to use for different titles if you wanted to. Okay, and you can see there are a number of uh, titles that are listed in here that you could pick. For instance, I picked a Thanksgiving one. Now, I realize that my, uh, that my theme is a little dark, so it's hard to see the preview of this. But um, I could import this if I wanted to and save it. All right, and then I could actually pull this over my video if I wanted to. Let me delete this. And uh, drag this over. Okay, and you can see now I have a clip art title if that was from the library. And if I wanted to, I could do further editing with it. Personally, I don't really use uh, clip art. I prefer to make my own titles and that sort of thing. Well, I hope you guys found this to be useful. Mm -hmm.